Hello and welcome back. My name is Vanessa Blank from Wild Woman Bushcraft. Today I have a day full of work here at my forest cabin. You know I had some projects here at the cabin. Inside it is now cozy, but outside there is something to do anymore. And I had a few problems here. One of them is that I had no water at the cabin. Um, well, at the end of the forest there is a lake and a creek, but it is far away and the water quality is not the best. So I had to think about it, what can I do here at my cabin, at my cabin that I had always fresh water. Today we have one of the first really warm spring days. I really enjoyed to feel the sun in the skin, um, don't have to heat in the cabin, walk without a jacket, I really enjoy it. But when the summer start and the hot days begin, I need much more water for my garden here. I planned a f I, I've planned a few plants and they start to grow now but they need more water. So I had to search for an idea which, uh, which what I can save water. You see the first green points at my plants. The blueberry grow very fast. And I also see here at the strawberries that the leaves are really dry. So I had to give them more water. Today I want to build a gutter. Yes, you hear it right. I don't buy one out of metal because here at the cabin everything is out of wood. And a metal gutter will not fit here into the scenery. So I want to build one at myself. And then I collect the rainwater here in this um, tube, in this metal tube. Um, I had here a point to open it if I want. And I need there two different kind of water. Um, drinking water, also um, water that I can filter for drinking and cooking and uh, normal using water. Water that I can fill in my solar shower or for the plants etc. So and in this one here I want to collect the rainwater. At the moment it is a little bit difficult to build something, to create something, because all the construction market are closed in this situation actually. So I can only use this what I have and I had to think about it. Um, if I can use tools for um, another um, with with another function I, I had to be creative. So um, this is another reason why I want to build um, the gutter out of this wooden beams, um, wooden boards. So my plan is fix this two here together and close the one side. The other side um, had to be open that the water can um, fall down there and normally this is a um, spruce wood when spruce gets wet it, it quill it is getting bigger and um, normally no water came through this but I'm not really sure if it works or not and when it is not uh, when water flow here between the two boards I had to plug them that it is uh, complete. So let's try if it works or not. Um, we will see. I want to fix the two wooden um, boards like this. So this should be then the gutter and that the wood doesn't um, broke. I had to make holes before um, that um, I had no, no holes later in the wood. To create the gutter is this work table here really good. The quality of the table is not the best. 
but it is good enough to work here outside in the forest because here I can fix the two boards um, that I can um, make the holes inside so yeah without it it would be really hard work only with the eyes can be good but I want to make it um, yeah, exactly so I check exactly the size of the board and here I mark the place where I um, put the screw later inside. Schraube bitte. Noch eine bitte. Johannes, Achtung, mit das jetzt oberflächlich. I fix these two boards um, together. I was a little afraid that I make it too strong because um, I, ha I am afraid that the um, beams broke down, but it have nothing. So they are really close together. And I hope that when the wood came together with water, with the rain, um, that this part here is complete closed but when not I had to make here a part with silicone or something else that it plugs here complete together this part here is then closed I make them here an ending part because I want that the water came only down at this side and I had to check the water level I want that this side is a little bit higher so that it can flow here um, down and here came also um, an, an cord no cord is not the right way it is uh, like an, um, like this one <laughs> this here I fix this one here and when it doesn't rain so strong the water flow down here and when we had a strong rain, rain, it will flow like it want. Ich 
ganz schön viel Winterspeck. This part is ready now and now I had to think how I can move it at the roof and fix it at the roof alone. It has a little bit weight, it is not too heavy, but I can't hold it and fix it in one alone. So this can be a problem. Um, I can build something to hold it while I fix it or I need help. So I had to look how I could uh, how I could do it. Do you see this part of the roof that looks like on top? My plan is to make the gutter, to fix the gutter under this plan so that the rainwater came from the roof down to my gutter and flow direct here inside. And I want to fix it at those big beams from the roof that you can see there. So this is my plan actually. I try to handle it alone, but it doesn't work. And I am afraid that um, when, I, when I hold it and fix it in one part, that I had one part where it is fixed and then the whole, white, whole weight is at one part and um, maybe this is too much weight and it fall down again. So uh, some of you always write me, why don't you uh, search help, why nobody help you. So I am the type um, of human who, who want to do all alone. <laughs> um, but I am actually at the part where I can't handle it alone. I need help. And maybe you hear it in the background, there is my wood neighbor. He helps me also with the last part of the bed, maybe you remember. And I want to ask him if I can, if he can spend five minutes and help me to fix it. And um, he will get a beer for it, so <laughs> I hope he had time. One and a an half hour later and three bottles beer later it is fixed at the roof and I'm very happy that I had such helpful neighbors here in the forest because I was never able to put this alone up on the roof. So you know the construction markets are closed so I had to use what I have and I had not the right tools. Um, they, they try it as best as they can do and it is fixed now, but not perfect. It is always good when you have enough beer in your house because everyone here in Bavaria loves beer and so you had a nice payment. You see that the gutter had not the complete length of the roof. This has the reason that um, there is a pine tree growing very close to the house and I cannot make the gutter here with the pine tree. It is not possible and I am not allowed to cut it away so I had to use what I have. And the second reason, the second reason why it is not so long as the roof is this um, that I have only this two wood um, beams. So the other ones are too short or too long or too massive and I will not um, cut so much from the wood away because this is all money. So I had to use what I have. And I had here three t uh, till two, two meters, so around six quadrat meters. And when it rains really strong, there came enough water together. And when I repaired the roof, I had the other side of the roof. And then I will make a um, gutter through all the length of the roof. And then I will have enough water. 
you see that here is the pine tree growing very close to the cabin so it was impossible to make the gutter true uh, between the house and the pine tree so the next step is ready i fixed this now and here should uh, the water fall down into my pot it is now ready to collect rainwater but I am not ready at this time because here is a roof and because of the roof it is always a little bit um, uh, there's a, a small hill and I want that it is even so I've built me on construction with the with the wood that I had on even ground here and then I want to make and cover here because in the summertime when it is really hot um, I lost much water because it is too hot and I don't want that an animal can fall inside and die inside so I want to close it with um, wood This here is uh, my construction. Here is the roof. It is only a small one, but enough that um, it stands like this. So here came another um, another wood on top, and then I fix everything. And then the water should fall down like this. construction is ready and now I need to build the cover with a hole for the rope. I've cut this now in the right size but it looks ugly like this. So I fix a beam here in the middle and then um, I make a circle. I make a circle line and I cut everything here away so that it fits perfect on top and then I need something to an, uh, like a handle to put it out and um, away so and then only the hole where the water came inside and then I am ready. den größten. Das hier ist der größte. Der da. Du kannst bitte wieder aufräumen. Ja. Danke. Naja, 
sehr schön ist was anderes, aber es ist funktional. Let's try if and how it works. I had here a bottle with water. I fill it now inside and um, when some water came on came into the, the tube, I am happy. You see that here the last meter is not, uh, you can water through the two different um, parts of wood and I had to check if it uh, closed from itself because the wood is getting bigger with the water or I had to fill it with silicone or something else. Till yet I always brought from home um, bottles like this with fresh water um, for the dish and the drinking water inside and yeah now I can use the rainwater I can filter the rainwater um, and when this here is full I can um, put another um, pot like this on top and then I had more um, space for safe oh. rainwater. When it is windy here in the forest a lot of needles um, fall down and they fall at my roof and from the roof uh, they came here to my water bottle and um, I don't want to have all of those needles inside of my water so um, I don't know the right English word in German, we call it sieb. It is like a pot with small holes that nothing um, bigger came, can came through the holes. So this will help me to get the needles out and also small animals and insects. And um, till I had this, I've put this um, wood here inside. If an um, animal fall inside of the water, it can climb here again outside. I have now a water reservoir and I am very happy about it. Of course this is not drink, uh, not drinking water quality. I had to filter it before I drink it. But um, I want to use this water for things like washing the hands, um, for the solar shower in the summer, for my plants that I plant here and when this pot is empty, it's, it's full, uh, when this pot is full, I can put another pot on top and can fill it again. So I think it will be enough when it rains enough. Of course, I had no idea if we get much rain this summer or not. And it, it uh, was now around eight hours where I work here. Of course, we had um, sometimes on break the children and I and then the forest neighbors wa was there and I had only two hands so it is getting a little bit slowly but I really enjoy to be outside here it is so warm the spring is there it is evening and still sun is there just great so thank you for watching and we see us again in the next video bye bye